Hi everybody, this is Maddie, and welcome back to my channel. But if you're new, welcome to my channel. Before we get into everything, first to make sure to like this video if you end up enjoying it. Comment whatever you want to comment. I love getting suggestions. It's very helpful. Um, also make sure to subscribe for more content. Um, it's a lot of good stuff here, clearly. And then also make sure to turn on that bell to know when I post. It's every Thursday, but just in case if you forget, you should totally turn that on. And then also make sure to follow my two Instagrams, my beauty one, which is modified makeup by mad and then my personal one which is Madeline McBride underscore today I'm going to be stretching my ears from 13 millimeters to 9 16 I am at an in-between size right now if you're wondering why I'm not at half an inch that's why the half an inch was a very easy size because I went 12 millimeters half an inch for me was 12.5 it depends on the brand and then I went to 13 so this is gonna be my first big millimeter jump because if I'm looking at the 9 16 plugs which I do have out it is roughly about 14 millimeters so I'm doing my first millimeter jump jump in a couple of sizes. Um, what I'm using to stretch is just glass plugs from Body Art Forms. I'm dead stretching if you're wondering so I don't use tapers. I just wear these for a little bit and then throw in the next size. If you remember in my last video when I put in the 13 millimeter it was very fucking easy um, because I was at half an inch for a really really long time. So it's only been about a week and now I'm gonna try putting in the 916 7 inch. So before we get into everything, let's see what we're gonna need. You wanna have your two sizes, they're both out of the bag. This one's in my ear right now, the 13 millimeter. Millimeter. 13 millimeter. And then this is my next one, 916 7 inch. Uh, something really helpful, you don't have to have it, is a gauge card. I get this from Body Art Forms every time I order from them. It's just really helpful to kind of figure out what you're doing. And then what you're gonna use to stretch with. So I use vitamin E oil. You can use jojoba oil, whatever you want. I really like my vitamin E oil. Um, I also have some antibacterial soap just to kind of clean out all the old dead skin. And then for me, just to kind of make things less messy, I use some Q-tips. So we're gonna start with my right side like we do in all my other videos. If I look rough in this video, your girl, I don't know why I'm holding my brush in my lap. Your girl has been a little depressed lately, but we're gonna be okay. There's my hole right now where it's at. I'm gonna clean it with a little bit of antibacterial soap. Um, I've just been having a lot of personal stuff happen, but today was one of the first days that I was feeling better. So I was like, we're gonna stretch my ears and see how it goes. And maybe it'll make my day better. Who knows? Maybe it'll just lighten up my whole world, you know? So now we're gonna take my vitamin E oil Put it on a little bit of a q-tip as so and we're gonna rub this on my little stinky ear anyone who's wondering i am stretching my ears to seven eighths that's my goal size um i don't know how long it's gonna take me to get there i have pretty stretchable ears they stretch very easily um and a lot of people have also been commenting and asking me this is the 9 16 of the plug i'll get to that in a second let me just try putting this in first yeah, just as I thought. Slid right in, bro. That's sick. Oh, I'm happy. Um, a lot of people were commenting like, hey, it seems like you're stretching your ears quickly, blah, blah, blah. I can see the concern. I'm not... This just came through the front side of my ear. Okay, well, we already know this one's ready to stretch, so let's just clean it. Um, there's a big-ass lip on this, too. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that. But the lip is big. As I was saying, my ears are very stretchy. So if it seems like I'm stretching fast, I just go with what my ears tell me. Um, I don't have any time basis of when I stretch. I just, I think it's Monday. I mean, today's a different day because like I said, I've been depressed. But usually every Monday, I will um, just try stretching my ears. And if it doesn't work, then it doesn't. And if it goes through, it does. Um, I just try once a week. I don't ever put it in if it hurts. I don't leave it in if it hurts. Um, and that's always been my rule. So if it's quick for you guys, you know, it's just, it's different for everyone. Everybody has different elasticity of their lobules, but we already know this one's gonna go in because the half an inch just tore right through the front. It's not half an inch. Have I been saying half an inch this entire time? 13 millimeters, my bad. But that was an easy video. Um, I was expecting this to be kind of an easy one. Um, every week, I'm just gonna try putting in the next size, which is 5 eighths of an inch. How 
big is five eighths of an inch? 16. So that's a two millimeter jump. This is going to be my first ever two millimeter jump. So I have a very strong feeling I'm going to be at nine sixteenths for quite some time. I don't know why there's not an in-between size for this one when I ordered it, but maybe it's just because it stops mattering the bigger you get. I don't know. So yeah, I will come back whenever I'm able to do that and we'll continue this journey. I think I only have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five more sizes until my goal size. I'm doing all in between sizes. So yeah, oh my gosh, we're like nearing the end. I will see you guys next week with another video and hopefully in two weeks with another ear stretching video. We'll see how long it takes my ears until they're ready to stretch. Um, you guys are amazing. So thankful for you and I'll see you then. Bye.